how to make your RC Tonka truck dump. It's really pretty easy. You need a 100 millimeter travel, 210 to 1 gear ratio, Fergelli Technologies linear actuator. And if you want to have a tailgate on it and make the tailgate move, you can also get the 30 millimeter travel, 50 to 1 gear ratio. For Gelly's linear actuator. Works great for that. As you can see, this is a pretty simple setup. It's a little little piece of half inch angle screwed to the side of the dump box with the clevis that comes with the actuators and the same thing back here. Now the front for the dump box is a little more complicated. I'll take the camera. Get a closer look of it. So down here, I had to cut a hole to for the actuator to stick through the frame. Then I had to make this U-shaped bracket. Just use some aluminum flat bar. And you use some more aluminum flat bar. I had to move the cab forward a little bit. You can see about how much, about three quarters of an inch. And then I attached the battery up here so it's out of the way, not going to fall out like it was before. It's got four channel receiver, Castle Creations BEC, uh, Castle Creations Sidewinder 3 speed control with an RC four wheel drive motor. Now this thing is really heavy so it's got a 15 tooth spur gear or pinion gear and a 90 tooth spur gear with no slipper clutch. It's got a waterproof high-tech sir steering servo in it that is completely not strong enough. But really it is very simple. Also that is the upper attachment point. Just the clevis that comes with the actuators. Real simple. See the cab looks a little better sitting up there. Move forward a little bit. I made some little angled aluminum brackets for that. I still need to put a screw in this one. It's a little bit loose but it's attached. The first video dump, dump truck video where it was dumping I had 2.2 tires on it. They were way too big. It didn't hardly drive with those on it. It does a lot better with the little 1.9 rock crushers. And I also put a block of foam here to help prevent overloading or a shock to the linear actuator when I dump a load of dirt into it. Here I will show you how strong these are. They will actually lift quite a bit of weight. Put down. Here's a 10 pound weight, solid steel. 10 pound says right on it, all over the place. You can tell it's heavy. The truck is almost 15 pounds without a load in it. And if you have a 10 pound load, it's a 25 pound RC dump truck. And it will lift 10 pounds. It struggles but it'll do it. I don't want it to fall off. Ten pounds. I can't even put ten pounds of dirt in there. 
So, real simple. One button for that. One button for the tailgate. Now, if you have any questions, please comment below, please like, and please subscribe.